Hello, and welcome to our How Far Away Is It 2021 review. You may recall last year that we thought this year we'd be covering a lot of photographs from the James Webb Space Telescope. But delays took it to Christmas Day. So we'll have to wait till next year for that. I'll have more on, on that later. But it was an interesting year, 2021. Interesting for astronomy, anyway. We'll see an asteroid that looks like a comet. We'll take a look at the winds in the storm on Jupiter. You may recall Osiris-Rex went to the asteroid Bennu. It has now left Bennu with rocks from the asteroid, and it's on its way back. So we'll cover that. We'll see new stars forming in Orion. Then we'll leave the Milky Way and see a couple of supernova. We'll revisit a diffuse galaxy that has no dark matter. We'll see a couple of interacting galaxies. We'll see a shadow in a galaxy that's 36,000 light years long. We'll cover a gamma ray burst that may very well be connected to the creation of a magnetar. We'll see a molten ring galaxy, a supernova with a prediction of a reappearance in 2037, a couple of double quasars, and Hamilton's object, 11 billion light years away. We'll end with a deep dive into Mars because we had three probes arrive at Mars this, this past year one from the United Arab Emirates one from China, and one from the U.S. But first, we'll start with an update on James Webb. I trust you'll find it interesting and entertaining. Thank you for watching.